Hello RC World, Scott Lenz from Namadio Incorporated. This week we are going to go over the uh, menu systems and navigating with React and also the timer functions. So to go into the menu system, we hit the menu button once and then use the down key to go down to advanced. Hit the positive key to go into advanced and we want to go into events because we are going to set the alert level for the temperature sensor. So we'll hit plus again to go into events and then we will scroll down with the down key to temperature plus key to go into the temperature and alert both or off sound or vibe. We will leave that on both. We we'll use the down key to go to temperature one maximum because we'll leave the minim minimum alone. We don't want a minimum alert. And we just have the temperature sensor at room temperature so we'll just pull that temperature down to like 90 degrees. and then hit menu to exit back out of there and menu again to go back another, another level and menu one more time and menu again and now we're back to the main menu and we see the transmitter battery level and if you hit the plus key you can scroll through any feeler inputs that you have attached to the transceiver so we will go to temperature 78 degrees and squeeze the temperature sensor with my fingers just to get it to go above uh, 90 degrees to set off the alarm and hopefully it'll go that high and you'll see the car is flashing with a little thermometer on there letting you know that your temperature has reached the alert level that you want it set at using timers on the react if you from the main screen if you just hit the positive key once the plus key you will get the timers to start timers you hit the up and plus key at the same time and that will start it running if you would like to use the lap feature the default setting is the grip, grip button so every time you hit the grip button it will go on to the next lap To stop the timer, you hit the plus and up key at the same time, and you still have your settings. To clear the timer, you hit the up and down key at the same time, and that will clear it off for you. And there you have it, um, navigating through the React and also using the timer functions. Um, you can contact me through support at nemadio.net if you have any questions or if you have any other ideas for uh, instructional videos. Thank you.